Now, one of the desires that we all have in our hearts is to make a difference in other people's lives, to live a life of significance and impact. There are two ways to do that, the hard way and the easy way. Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond, and welcome again to Fresh. Out of every 100 people that you know out there, perhaps one will at some point in their lives actually pick up a Bible and read it. The other 99 are much more likely to read something else, your life. In fact, your life may be the only Bible they ever read. So you hear that and you start thinking to yourself, I have to live a better life. I have to be a better witness to the majesty and the grace and the mercy of Jesus. But life goes on and you keep on failing. In fact, every time we try to do stuff in our own strength to honour God, we will fall flat on our faces. Have you noticed that? That's why we need to be filled with the Holy Spirit, not just once, but over and over again. Ephesians chapter 5, verse 18. Don't be drunk with wine, which will ruin your life, but go on being filled with the Spirit. Every morning, I ask God to fill me with his Holy Spirit. And when we do that, we discover that whilst we can't hold a lot, we can overflow an immeasurable amount. The Bible says, go on being filled with the Holy Spirit. In other words, it's an ongoing process, not just a one-time event. This isn't just an optional extra, it's a command and for good reason. You and I can't make a difference in this world in our own strength. But when the Holy Spirit overflows out of you, hey, watch out. God is about to do some powerful things. Go on being filled with the Spirit. That's God's Word, fresh for you today. Friend, the Holy Spirit yearns to speak His love and His power and His truth and His encouragement into our lives. And it turns out that He is rather a creative an edgy communicator. And that's what my special edition book, How Can I Hear God Speak to Me, is all about. To request your free copy, head across to ChristianityWorks.com and you'll see that free offer toward the top of the homepage. Again, that web address is ChristianityWorks.com. May you be blessed as you receive God's word into your heart.